Hi everyone, here's a short preview for worship this coming Sunday, May 9th. Been thinking about how in situations of uncertainty, in anxious times, it really helps to make a plan. Right now we've been working on our reopening plan, a plan for how we're going to come back into this sanctuary for uh, in-person worship. We've been thinking about how we're going to come into the building, how we're going to exit the building, how we're going to get downstairs, how we're going to go through the assembly room. I know once we have a sense of that plan, we are going to feel much more confident coming back into the building and knowing that we'll be safe here as we interact with each other. You know, there's other such plans in scripture. I've been thinking about the golden rule, for example, um, do unto others as you would have them do unto you. There's a, a sense in that uh, rule of, 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 of a plan for how to behave, right? Of, there's almost a, a movement implied that we start by reflecting on how we want to be treated. And then from there, we kind of go to figure out how to treat other people. Well, we have another one of these rules or um, in uh, John 15, Jesus calls it a commandment coming up this Sunday. Jesus says, this is my commandment, that you love one another as I have loved you. It's kind of like the golden rule in that it suggests how we should be treating each other, but it's a little different because we're not just talking about our behavior, what we do. It's talking about love, and love is, is more than just what we do. It's kind of who we are or how we are to each other, right? So here's my question. Can being a disciple to Jesus really make us more loving? Is there, is there a way in which following him not only changes what we do, but how we do it? I mean, that's implied in this scripture, but I'm looking for a plan. I don't want to just talk about love in some sort of theoretical sense. I want a flow chart. <laughs> I want a step-by-step -step method. I want to know how we get in and how we leave. I want to know how we go through this thing called love. If you tune in on Sunday on Zoom, maybe we'll create that flow chart together. We'll see if we can do it. I'll, I'll see you Sunday.